Have you ever wanted to implement RFID into your next project, but you felt like it was overwhelming perhaps? Well, today we're going to look at a development kit that helps you implement RFID quickly into your product and probably save about six to nine months of development time. Hi, I'm Josh from SemiconductorStore.com and today I'm excited to have on this video Stefano from Florence, Italy from a company called Cayenne and he's going to talk to us about his brand new dev kit that helps you implement RFID into just about any product and save a bunch of time. Stefano, welcome to the video. Hi, Josh. Nice to see you. Hey, well, talk to us a little bit about your Quark Up dev kit that helps us save six to nine months of dev time on an RFID solution. Yeah, let me show you uh, the box you will receive if you get this product. This box like that, containing all the electronic things. So uh, the main uh, product, the main thing you can find in the, in the dev kit is this board. That is an adapter board with a USB connector. And the, the core of the product that is this very small UHF RFID module. It's a complete reader, just in this small size, and it's able to read up to three, four feet away a, a simple label. I show you this. This is what you get together with the antenna that you can connect to it to read the tags, and then you get also some uh, sample labels inside the, inside the kit. I show you some of the labels that you could find in uh, some product in retail stores or supermarket or whatever. So this is what you get. And you get also some special label, some special tags like those one with a temperature sensor inside. Wow. All these included in the kit. That's great. So those labels are what actually goes on the product so that you can start implementing this and testing it immediately. Is that right? Sorry? So those labels are what goes on the product and you can start testing this immediately with this dev kit. Exactly, exactly. You connect this board to the to the PC with a with a USB cable, yeah. very simple one, and the antenna to the model uh, just with this connector and you can start reading the tags, reading the information inside the label immediately. Just That's in fantastic. Five so walk us through Stefano, how is RFID a game changer? Yeah, let's say RFID is mostly related to improve efficiency in the operations. So the most the most important implementation right now is in the big retailer uh, like uh, American Apparel or Macy's. Uh, they are and on Walmart also. They are uh, putting the labels in their products so they can improve the efficiency and inventory management. They can reduce the stock uh, shrinkage. Uh, and they, and consequently, they can improve sales. There are some statistics, some studies made by analysts that make that says that they can uh, improve sales from five to twenty percent, depending on the uh, on the operation of those retailers. So that is the biggest impact uh, of RFID technology right now. But still, uh, even. Uh, many other applications can get advantages from this uh, breakthrough technology. And I think there's one, if I may, uh, based on what you've told me in past discussions, it also saves labor and time to reading the data about the products. Because in the yeah. past they were using USB, which takes a lot of labor, and now RFID gives you more speed. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. Let's say the, the efficiency as, uh, is... Uh, related on the time you need to make an inventory. So let's say you you have a, a big store with a, with thousands of articles around the store, and you have to make an inventory to know what you have and what yeah. you already sold. Then you go there and you count manually, or in, in the best case, you use barcode reading to to scan codes one by one. With RFID, you can scan. Uh, hundreds and thousands of articles just in a few seconds. And that gives you a uh, saves labor time and permits you to make the inventory every day while now they make it every year or something like that. So it's a, it's a huge improvement in that part. And so you saves a lot of time and you improve the efficiency. 
That's great. That brings me to my next question. What does the Quirk Up Dev Kit give us, and how is this a game changer? Yeah, let's say, you know, if you are a, a manufacturer of, broad, of uh, um, RFID devices or whatever, uh, that you need the RFID technology inside the product, like uh, you can you can have you can build uh, handled uh, mobile uh, computers, or you can build uh, point of sales machines, or you can make uh, uh, magic mirrors or whatever. Then you need uh, to implement the RFID technology inside for to, to sell your product to to the retailers for for this purpose of improving their efficiency. So if you start to develop your UHF RFID from scratch, you may need six to nine months of development time to get uh, a, a real, very well performing RFID reader. With this, with this guy, you just buy this, that is a complete UHF RFID reader in that small size that you can embed this in your product in, in a week, let's say. Okay. I, I can show you an example. Here I have uh, a box, a white box with a USB cable. And if you look at inside, there is the the use the um, development kit in, in essence because it, there is the same antenna you can find in your dev kit. You have the adapter board and the quad cap module inside. So that is you just screw a uh, few screws, you close the box, and you have a reader, a, fi a finished product. And this is a post reader or whatever. You can install this in a wall, and you have a, a reading point. I can install that in an uh, industrial uh, environment and you have a, a reading point for uh, industrial automation or a sorting system, whatever. Simple like that. That's great. That leads me to my next question, which are what are some actual use cases for this? How can we best utilize it in real life examples? And I think you kind of started to explain that in that box right there. Yeah, let's say uh, we already talked about the inventory management, you know, making inventory very efficiently, yeah. uh, then you can use that for asset tracking. You would like to, to, to track your assets and you can use RFID for doing that very efficiently. Uh, you, make, you can make uh, access control, so for example you have a parking, a parking lot, you can install a reading point like that one and you have a badge and you can read it from distance. So you don't have to, to put your hands out of the window and and start to scratch on the reader. You just uh, have your your badge uh, on the on the car, and you can pass through. Or uh, we have a lot of projects about uh, waste management here in Italy uh, and in, around Europe. Uh, you, you can we can use the RFID in the healthcare um, for reduction of errors in drugs administration, for example. Mm -hmm. Or you can use the RFID, especially this module, to to create uh, uh, devices for customer experience and engagement, like uh, magic mirrors, where you stand in front of the mirror in the shop with your clothes, and the mirror suggests reads your text, the text of the clothes, and suggests you the best combination for what you already bought or you would like to buy. Mm -hmm. So there are many, many, many different applications. It's, it's only our imagination that limits. Uh, what you can do with the RFID. So I have two more questions. Uh, number one, does it, what is the, actually three questions, what is the power draw? Does it come with software and what is the approximate distance that it will read? Yeah, let's say one of the, the strength, the strength point of the, uh, of this module is the power consumption. Mm -hmm. This module was uh, designed to be Install it specifically in battery powered devices like mobile readers or uh, let's say things that are not connected to the power line. So the power consumption is very important and it draws very low power consumption. Let's say uh, it gets uh, less than, uh, I don't know, a bit more than uh, 500 milliwatt, uh, milliamp. Uh, that means that, uh, and, and with this power, uh, you can run it at full power, full 
radiation power. That means you can reach the, the, the best read range of labels. That depends on the antenna, but it could reach a couple of meters. That means, I think, six feet, something like that, Fantastic. of reading room. So you can read uh, article ID from two meters. But most importantly, you can read multiple tags at a time. So you can read a hundred tags in a couple of seconds, something like that. So that's uh, a huge improvement. Uh, then you ask the power consumption and read range. Power, you say that. Yeah, power consumption range, and you're saying that the fascinating thing and the, the way in which I believe this is a game changer for those of you that are watching this video is that you can read hundreds of these at once, which is great. I have one more question. Does it come with software or does it need software? Oh, yeah, right. Um, yes, we, we provide uh, a kit of software also that you can download freely from our website. And it includes uh, APIs for most of the, uh, uh, common, the most common uh, programming languages like Java, uh, C Sharp, like .NET, um, C, and CC. Uh, and then you have all the drivers, obviously, to, to be connected. We also provide a, a library for Android for mobile devices. So you can connect to the, to the reader using a tablet or a smartphone. And then we provide uh, demo software. So they are example of programming the, the, uh, the reader. So, and we provide that in source code. So for a, for a programmer, for a de software developer, it would be very easy to take this code, look inside the details, and develop their own specific application for their customers. That's great. Well, Stefano, I want to thank you for being on this video today. Thanks to you. It was a pleasure. Thank you very much. And those of you that are watching this video, you can learn more at semiconductorstore.com where you can buy this dev kit to save about six to nine months on implementing RFID into your project. And as you heard, this is a pretty incredible game changer. You can read a ton of different products at a time, up to probably 100 or even more, within a few seconds. And it's got a, a long range, so you don't have to put things right up next to it. Uh, load, it's, the, the draw is very low, and it's exciting. So we here at SemiconductorStore.com are excited. You can learn more by clicking the links below this video. I'm Josh. I'm honored to have Stefano from Cayenne in Florence, Italy, live on this video. If you have any more questions, you can comment below the video, subscribe above, and click the links below to visit our site to learn more about this product. Hey, thanks so much for watching. I look forward to seeing you on a future video. Have a great day, everybody.